have arrived on the helipad. Use the camera controls to move the camera around your lair. Now use the rotate controls to rotate the camera. You can use the zoom controls to zoom in and out. Hold on. Who do you think you are? Giving me instructions like that? Uh, I I'm here to help. By telling you exactly what to do next in a friendly and helpful manner. But you're here to do everything I say. Correct. Step one. Tell us what you want and the minions will do it. We're eager to please. Uh, and also e eager to live. Please stop looking at me like that. Your lair will be much more impressive once it has more rooms. Open the build menu. You need a place to store your gold. Select the vault icon. Paint tiles over the highlighted area. This will be where we'll build your vault. Gold pallets will increase the amount of gold you can keep in your lair. It's best not to leave your gold sitting in the open. Add a door to your vault. Once you are done, select Confirm to give the order to your minions. Wait for your minions to install the door before moving on. Ordered furniture must first be collected from the depot under the helipad.
attainable. Now your gold is safe, let's add another room to the lair. Minions need to rest after a day of evil deeds. Let's build a barracks. Beds give minions places to sleep when their vitality or morale start to run low. Items can be rotated freely with the rotate controls. Items that need to be placed next to a wall will automatically rotate. Place some beds on the other side of the barracks. Doors can be placed between walls. They always need a gap of four tiles. Once you are done, select confirm to give the order to your minions. Open the systems menu. New main objective available. Objectives will help pave the way to world domination. Optional objectives will give you small frequent challenges. Collect this one now for a reward. Come back here often for main objectives, side stories, and optional objectives. Food is an essential part of any minion's diet. Without it, they'll become more unhealthy and less intelligent. Much less intelligent. Build a mess hall. You can rotate any item in your lair. You can also move them after they've been constructed. New main objective available. Basic food counters restore minions' hearts and vitality and stop stomachs from rumbling. It seems we're low on power. Let's fix that before continuing. Build space for a power station. You can place this where you like, but be careful, as it will be a tempting target for enemy agents.
Generators power items in the lair. Without it, almost nothing will function. Be careful, as enemy agents will attempt to sabotage your generators if they find them. It sure is dark, isn't it? Are you scared? No? Me, me neither. Defeated agents lie in body bags on the floor, causing minions to lose morale if they get too close. Build an incinerator in your power station to dispose of them. Available. Open the character selection panel, then select the evil genius portrait to highlight and follow your evil genius. Prepare for power! With the evil genius selected, interact anywhere in the highlighted area to move your genius. On my way! Why isn't this finished yet? Oh! 
Fine. New main objective available. You need a control room to send minions into the world. Let's lay down a plan for one. Radio repeaters provide broadcast strength, allowing us to maintain criminal networks across the globe. The more broadcast strength you generate with your radio repeaters, the more of the world you can infiltrate. For now, let's just infiltrate a little bit. Salaries paid.
Are you gonna make help? Oh, Come on, one okay. of you. Oh, no. Yes, I think. Yeah. Oh, oh that's really good. New main objective available. Head to the world stage. Each of the highlighted regions is an excellent place to start your journey towards world domination. Select a suggested region, or any other region if you know what you are doing, and scout it to establish a criminal network. You can speed things up by selecting fast forward at any time. Once built, you can use our criminal network to run schemes in this region. I'm all packed, boss. Send me into the world, and I'll come back with plenty of gold. Come back? You think you're coming back? Oh, I'm not having you coming back here, tracking justice all over the place like mud. They'll follow you right to my door, and then where will we be? Take a little gold for yourself, then send the rest back here. Use your share to live a quiet life, or else. Minions will travel to the world and run any scheme you select. You will receive small amounts of gold as they progress. A prison will make for the perfect place to hold your enemies before questioning them. These holding cells hold one prisoner each. If you don't have any free cells, your minions can't capture people. Once this interrogation chair is built, we can use it to make prisoners tell us their secrets.
New main objective available. Experiment with interrogating agents. You never know what secrets you will uncover. A new criminal network has been established. Where we're going, we don't need roads. Head to the world stage to recruit a scientist. Select a scientist scheme. Special schemes are often highlighted on the world stage with colored signs. Keep your eyes open for these important schemes. Optional objective complete.
Once complete, the scheme will yield you a fresh-faced scientist. I'm ready to uncover the mysteries of the universe for you, boss. What do you want me to research? Interesting word, research. Implies you're searching for something a second time. You'd better not be charging me for the same work twice. Your new scientist appears to believe that we can use a training room to teach our slack-jawed minions how to do specialist jobs. Get one built and you can find out for sure. New optional objective available. Build more rockers if you want more minions. Salaries paid. Each specialist minion type requires a trainer of its own. Request a scientist trainer. Once built, you will be able to instruct your minions to train as scientists. Having more scientists will speed up future research. New optional objective available. Your criminal networks are idle. Consider running some schemes. With the correct training furniture built in your training room, you can request that your minions train to become specialists. 
head to the minion training screen to request training of some new scientists. You should request two scientists to be trained. Thankfully, we already have a scientist, so training another should be a breeze. If for some reason one of your scientists disappears, another minion will instantly train until they have this many in your lair again. Useful. Your workers will start to train automatically. They'll learn faster if another minion is able to teach them. Available. Your minions will need somewhere to perform their research. Plan a laboratory. New optional objective available. A whiteboard is essential for scientists to perform research. As we unlock more potent research, we'll need to provide them with more advanced equipment. Available. Open the research screen and take a look at all the diabolical opportunities.
Choose any research project and set your scientists researching it. We suggest increasing your minion capacity, but ultimately the choice is yours, oh wise one. You are blessed with powerful abilities which can be used to further influence those around you. Select your genius. I'm thinking. This ability increases the importance and speeds of jobs within your area of influence. Move to a busy area of your lair, such as your control room, and trigger the ability. Notice how your minions come running to help. This can be very useful when you want to give the productivity in your lair a bit of a boost. If your genius isn't in the busy room, try moving to somewhere there are jobs to be done and try again. Objective available. Side stories are objectives that will unlock powerful additions to your empire. You should start by learning about how guards work. Once you have done that, you can learn about new minion types. What we need is a little more muscle around here. You there! How much can you lift? About 70 kilos on a good day. 80 if I use both hands. And how many bullet wounds can you take before you give up? One, maybe two. My point exactly. Get out there and find someone strong. Learn their secrets. Many objectives require you to send different types of minions to run special schemes. Let's go to the world stage to get started. One of the highlighted schemes is near one of your criminal networks. You can send minions to complete the scheme now, or you can search the globe for an alternative. Minions have kidnapped a specialist. Once they're in a holding cell, you can choose to interrogate them.
is paid. We have captured an intruder. Select the holding cell and then select escort prisoner. After that, select the interrogation device. For now, that's the interrogation chair. Your criminal networks are idle. Consider running some schemes. An agent has resisted our interrogation. I command you, ignore this intruder. If you see them, I want the intruder captured. Hunt them down. Find and distract. I want that intruder found and captured. New optional objective available.
scheme has succeeded. An intruder has been captured. An intruder has been captured. Your scientists have discovered something. With all these new recruits, you should expand your training room to make space for all those exotic training machines. Research has begun. Your criminal networks are idle. Consider running some schemes. Guards are important to the security of your lair, but can disappear quicker than a dry martini. Build two guard trainers so that your minions can top up their wilting numbers post haste. escaped captivity.
Once constructed, we can use the minion training screen to request our minions start their training to become fully fledged guards. Won't that be nice? <coughs> training screen to request some advanced minions. We have two guard trainers, so set your lair to always try and maintain four guards. When they are defeated in combat, your minions will quickly train and create new guards to take their place at your side. Wow, look at them go. I could do that, but I don't want to. Guards are just one of the muscle type minions you will be able to find as you expand your empire.
objective available. Now that you have enough guards to support them, request some guard posts towards the entrance to your lair. During high alert, your guards will diligently man these aptly named guard posts. An intruder has escaped captivity. up some movement near your lair. Keep an eye out for incoming agents. New optional objective available. Guards like to use their muscles to defeat agents. Tag this agent for swift termination. An intruder is in the lair. Kill them! Turn on high alert and watch as your minions scurry to deal with any tagged agents they find in your lair.
Nicely done. Turn off high alert. Once you have finished dancing. Fisty cuffs are an occupational hazard for your guards and lowers their vitality. A short stay in the infirmary can patch them right up. An intensive care pod like this can officially deal with 1,000 boo-boos per hour. Actual results may vary. If a minion's vitality gets too low, they will go to the closest infirmary to attempt to heal. If their vitality reaches zero, then it might be time to hire a new minion. Well done. Your horde of guards will be the first line of defense and help to keep the riffraff out. Collect the completed side story to continue your world domination. Oh, this is more like it. Tell me, what do you bench press? The biggest one. Right, okay. Not quite what I expected. How many bullet wounds would it take to kill you? The biggest one. Are you okay? Wait, I don't want to know. You're hired. One down, two to go. 
Select a new minion side story from the objective screen. An intruder has been captured. <laughs> 